the plane. Coffee? Yes, please. Milk and sugar? No, thanks. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Oh, that's all right. Are you German? Yes, I'm from Munich. And you? I'm from Aberdeen. So you're English? Actually, I'm Scottish. Oh, sorry. I'm Stefan. And I'm Stephen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> On the plane. Coffee? Yes, please. Milk and sugar? No, thanks. Oh, I'm sorry. That's all right. Are you German? Yes, I'm from Munich. And you? I'm from Aberdeen. So you're English? Actually, I'm Scottish. Oh, sorry. I'm Stefan. And I'm Stephen. At the terminal. Are you lost? Hi, Stephen. Hello, Stephen. Uh, we're over there. Oh, yes. Flight BA-946 from Munich. Here are the cases. One case, <coughs> one rucksack, and one travel bag. Ah, they're all here. Are they heavy? The case is very heavy. Can you lift it? Yes, I can. But I can't carry it. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> it is heavy. Oh. Here are two trolleys. Oh, good. Here we are. Customs control. Red, green or blue exit? Blue. For the EU. The European Union. That's right. At the terminal. Are you lost? Hi, Stephen. Hello, Stefan. We're over there. Oh, yes. Flight BA-946 from Munich. Here are the cases. One case, one rucksack, and one travel bag. They're all here. Are they heavy? The case is very heavy. Can you lift it? Yes, I can, but I can't carry it. Oh, yes, it is heavy. Here are two trolleys. Oh, good. Here we are. Customs control. Red, green or blue exit? Blue. For the EU. The European Union. That's right. A coach journey. Excuse me, where's the Oxford bus stop? It's over there, on the right. Thank you. Is this the stop for Oxford? Yes, it is. Thanks. Ah, here's the bus. That's the Cambridge bus. The Oxford bus is blue, white and yellow. When is the next bus to Oxford? At 11.30. 11.30? But it's 12 o'clock. Oh, I'm an idiot. We're in England. It's 11 o'clock here. <laughs> A ticket to Oxford, please. Single or return? Single, please. That's nine fifty. Sorry, uh, how much? Nine pounds fifty. Thank you. There you are. 50 pence change. Thanks. But how long is the journey? 90 minutes. That's an hour and a half. I can read the paper or sleep. A coach journey. 
Excuse me, where's the Oxford bus stop? It's over there, on the right. Thank you. Is this the stop for Oxford? Yes, it is. Thanks. Ah, here's the bus. That's the Cambridge bus. The Oxford bus is blue, white and yellow. When is the next bus to Oxford? At 11.30. 11.30? But it's 12 o'clock. Oh, I'm an idiot. We're in England. It's 11 o'clock here. A ticket to Oxford, please. Single or return? Single, please. That's 9.50. Sorry? How much? £9.50. Thank you. There you are. 50 pence change. Thanks. How long is the journey? 90 minutes. That's an hour and a half. I can read the paper or sleep. Meeting people. Hello. You must be Stefan Koenig. That's right. And you're Mrs. Young? Yes. Nice to meet you, Stefan. Uh, come in. Oh, thank you. Leave the bags in the hall. You must be tired and hungry. I'm not very hungry. Well, have a cup of tea and a sandwich, then. Mm, yes, please. Come in and sit down. This is Lucia. She's from Italy. And Akiro. He's from Japan. Hello. Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you. A sandwich for you two? No, thanks. We aren't hungry. Lucia and Akiro are students at the Excel Language School, too. They're here for six months. Is it a good school? Well, I'm happy there, but Akiro isn't. Why? It's full of Japanese. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs> Meeting people. Hello. You must be Stefan Koenig. That's right. And you're Mrs. Young? Yes. Nice to meet you, Stefan. Come in. Thank you. Leave the bags in the hall. You must be tired and hungry. I'm not very hungry. Have a cup of tea and a sandwich, then. Mm, yes, please. Come in and sit down. This is Lucia. She's from Italy. And Akiro. He's from Japan. Hello. Hi. Hello. Nice to meet you. A sandwich for you two? No, thanks. We aren't hungry. Lucia and Akiro are students at the Excel Language School, too. They're here for six months. Is it a good school? Well, I'm happy there, but Akiro isn't. Why? It's full of Japanese. Oh, dear. In the wrong room. Oh, this isn't my room. Sorry, Akira. That's OK. Your room is opposite. Yes, of course. And Lucia's is next to it. She's got a wash basin in her room and a spare bed. And you've got a nice big table and an extra chair and a television. Is it your TV? Yes, it is. It's very good for my English. That's true. Has it got a sports channel? It's got three. I've got my Walkman, but it hasn't got a radio. They've got a radio in the kitchen and satellite TV in the sitting room and in the bedroom and the study. Well, that's good, but I haven't got time for that now. Who's that? Oh, it's you, Lucia. Hello. Oh, hi, Stefan. 
Isn't Akira's room lovely? Yes, it is. This is a nice house. And it's got two bathrooms, three toilets, and four TVs. And mm. very nice owners. One student in my class is with his third family already. Oh, we are lucky. We're so happy here with Mr. and Mrs. Young. In the wrong room. Oh, this isn't my room. Sorry, Akiro. That's okay. Your room is opposite. Yes, of course. And Lucia's is next to it. She's got a wash basin in her room and a spare bed. And you've got a nice big table and an extra chair and a television. Is it your TV? Yes, it is. It's very good for my English. That's true. Has it got a sports channel? It's got three. I've got my Walkman, but it hasn't got a radio. They've got a radio in the kitchen and satellite TV in the sitting room and in the bedroom and the study. That's good, but I haven't got time for that now. Who's that? Oh, it's you, Lucia. Hello. Oh, hi, Stefan. Isn't Akira's room lovely? Yes, it is. This is a nice house, and it's got two bathrooms, three toilets, and four TVs. And very nice owners. One student in my class is with his third family already. We are lucky. We're so happy here with Mr. and Mrs. Young. At breakfast. Good morning. Morning, Stefan. Where is everybody? Ah, here's Akiro. Morning. The Youngs are at work. Yes, they get up at 6.30 and Mr. Young leaves at quarter past seven. He works for a bank in the city and he often gets back late. He lives in his office. And Mrs. Young? She goes ten minutes later. She teaches at a primary school. Then we have our breakfast. And we leave at twenty past eight. I always have lunch in town at midday. And Lucia has a snack at the school in the afternoon. And we usually come back for our supper in the evening. Yes, we have dinner with the family. The family? Mr and Mrs Young and Rover. That's their dog. They normally have their evening meal at half past seven. Lucia sometimes does the cooking. <laughs> it's good because we speak English with English people. And with an English dog. <laughs> yes, <laughs> its English is very good. Cornflakes or muesli, Stefan? Muesli, please. I love muesli in the morning. You're in England now, Stefan. Have the cornflakes. OK. After all, this is my first English breakfast. I like egg and bacon, too. At breakfast. Good morning. Morning, Stefan. Where is everybody? Ah, here's Akiro. Morning. The youngs are at work. Yes. They get up at 6.30 and Mr Young leaves at quarter past seven. He works for a bank in the city and he often gets back late. He lives in his office. And Mrs Young? She goes ten minutes later. She teaches at a primary school. Then we have our breakfast. And we leave at twenty past eight. I always have lunch in town at midday, and Lucia has a snack at the school in the afternoon. And we usually come back for our supper in the evening. Yes, we have dinner with the family. The family? Mr and Mrs Young and Rover. That's their dog. 
They normally have their evening meal at half past seven. Lucia sometimes does the cooking. It's good because we speak English with English people. And with an English dog. Yes, its English is very good. Cornflakes or muesli, Stefan? Muesli, please. I love muesli in the morning. You're in England now, Stefan. Have the cornflakes. Okay. After all, this is my first English breakfast. I like egg and bacon too. The lost key. Look, there's a key on the fridge. Whose key is it? I don't know. My key's in my pocket. And my key's upstairs. It must be Mrs. Young's. I don't think it is. She doesn't forget things. <laughs> yes, but she sometimes leaves her key on the fridge. Let me see. Oh yes, it's her key ring. She can't get in. Why not? She gets back at four, and we don't usually get home before five. And Mr. Young doesn't finish work before seven. What can we do? Well, I can come home after lunch. That's right. You don't come to the conversation class at two. No, I don't. So that's no problem. Hello, Stefan. You're back early. I know. But why aren't you inside? It's wet and cold outside, and you haven't got a coat on. I can't get in. Why not? Because my key's in my room. Oh, but that's no problem now. I've got the door key somewhere in this bag. But, uh, Mrs. Young. Oh dear, where's my key? I can't find it. Well, uh, Mrs. Young, it's in the kitchen, on the fridge. The lost key. Look, there's a key on the fridge. Whose key is it? I don't know. My key's in my pocket. And my key's upstairs. It must be Mrs. Young's. I don't think it is. She doesn't forget things. Yes. But she sometimes leaves her key on the fridge. Let me see. Oh yes, it's her key ring. She can't get in. Why not? She gets back at four, and we don't usually get home before five. And Mr. Young doesn't finish work before seven. What can we do? Well, I can come home after lunch. That's right. You don't come to the conversation class at two. No, I don't. So that's no problem. Hello, Stefan. You're back early. I know. But why aren't you inside? It's wet and cold outside, and you haven't got a coat on. I can't get in. Why not? Because my key's in my room. Oh, but that's no problem now. I've got the door key somewhere in this bag. But um, Mrs. Young. Oh dear, where's my key? I can't find it. Well, um, Mrs. Young. It's in the kitchen, on the fridge. Keeping fit. Hi, Kiro. Do you go to classes on Friday afternoons? No, I don't. I meet a friend here, and we go to the sports center. What do you do there? Do you do sumo wrestling? <laughs> no, we don't. We play basketball. How much does it cost? It doesn't cost much for students. Do you want to come? Maybe next time. Okay. Do men and women go there? Yes, they do. Why do you ask? Oh, I don't know. Does 
Lucia go there too? No, she doesn't. She sometimes goes to the Viking gym in the town centre on Saturdays. The Viking gym? Gym is short for gymnasium. Gymnasium? Does she go to school on Saturdays? Of course not. She goes to a fitness centre. A gym is a sports centre. Oh, what does she do there? Exercises. Exercises? You know, press-ups. Bodybuilding exercises. I see. She doesn't do sumo wrestling then? No, <laughs> of course not. <laughs> Only very heavy men do sumo wrestling. Not heavy women. <laughs> Stefan, don't be so cheeky. Keeping fit. Hi, Akira. Do you go to classes on Friday afternoons? No, I don't. I meet a friend here and we go to the sports centre. What do you do there? Do you do sumo wrestling? No, we don't. We play basketball. How much does it cost? It doesn't cost much for students. Do you want to come? Maybe next time. OK. Do men and women go there? Yes, they do. Why do you ask? Oh, I don't know. Does Lucia go there too? No, she doesn't. She sometimes goes to the Viking gym in the town centre on Saturdays. The Viking gym? Gym is short for gymnasium. Gymnasium? Does she go to school on Saturdays? Of course not. She goes to a fitness centre. A gym is a sports centre. Oh. What does she do there? Exercises. Exercises? You know, press-ups. Bodybuilding exercises. I see. She doesn't do sumo wrestling, then? No, of course not. Only very heavy men do sumo wrestling. Not heavy women? Stefan, don't be so cheeky. Shopping in town. Apples, pears, juicy plums. Have you got any sweet apples, please? These are very sweet. I'd like two pounds, please. And um, a pound of those black grapes. And this pineapple. That's three pounds sixty. And uh, forty pence change. Thank you. Oh, Stefan, you're shopping too. Yes, I'm buying some fruit. <laughs> I haven't got any at home. I'm getting some things for Mrs. Young. She's very busy. Oh? Yes, she's buying clothes in London. So I'm doing the shopping and the cooking today. That's very good of you, Lucia. <laughs> I'm enjoying it. It's fun. I'd like some um, Italian food, please. Well, you're lucky. The youngs aren't eating at home, so there's no English supper tonight. What? No fish and chips? <laughs> Are you cooking spaghetti? No, I'm not. We're having a lasagna. And Akira, is he having supper at home too? No, he isn't. He goes to the sports centre on Fridays, and he often comes back late. Ah. I'm really looking forward to supper. Shopping in town. Have you got any sweet apples, please? These are very sweet. I'd like two pounds, please. And a pound of those black grapes. And this pineapple. That's three pounds sixty. And forty pence change. Thank you. Stefan! You're shopping too. Yes, I'm buying some fruit. 
I haven't got any at home. I'm getting some things for Mrs. Young. She's very busy. Oh? Yes, she's buying clothes in London. So I'm doing the shopping and the cooking today. That's very good of you, Lucia. I'm enjoying it. It's fun. I'd like some Italian food, please. Well, you're lucky. The Youngs aren't eating at home, so there's no English supper tonight. What? No fish and chips? Are you cooking spaghetti? No, I'm not. We're having lasagna. And Akiro, is he having supper at home too? No, he isn't. He goes to the sports centre on Fridays, and he often comes back late. I'm really looking forward to supper. Planning a trip. Pass me the newspaper, please, Lucia. Which paper? The Independent or the Oxford Times? Oh, give me the local paper. Here you are. By the way, I'm going on a trip with some friends tomorrow, Stefan. Oh, are you? Would you like to come? Yes, I'd love to. <sighs> I'm not doing very much tomorrow. Is Akiro coming too? No, he isn't going out. He's giving a presentation at school next week. Ah, and Mrs. Young is helping him. That's right. That's very kind of her. Where are we meeting your friends? We're meeting them in town at about nine. And what are we doing so early? We're going to Warwick Castle. Oh, where's that? In Warwick, of course. <laughs> Look, here's a map of England. Let me show you. Planning a trip. Pass me the newspaper, please, Lucia. Which paper? The Independent or the Oxford Times? Oh, give me the local paper. Here you are. By the way, I'm going on a trip with some friends tomorrow, Stefan. Oh, are you? Would you like to come? Yes, I'd love to. I'm not doing very much tomorrow. Is Akiro coming too? No, he isn't going out. He's giving a presentation at school next week. Ah, and Mrs. Young is helping him. That's right. That's very kind of her. Where are we meeting your friends? We're meeting them in town at about nine. And what are we doing so early? We're going to Warwick Castle. Oh, where's that? In Warwick, of course. Look, here's a map of England. Let me show you.